So the Alter G is an anti-gravity treadmill. Um, it pumps air into a negative pressure system um, to take body weight out of the equation. Uh, we can step on a treadmill and walk or run, change the incline, um, but we're doing that with 100% of our body weight. Um, so if we're dealing with an injury or if we're trying to build up a capacity to tolerate load, um, oftentimes um, if there's any pain or any kind of discomfort or if there's a restriction in your ability to put weight onto a certain uh, body part, then it's going to prevent you from getting onto a treadmill. Whereas our Alter G, we don't have those restrictions. We can really quickly get people back into activity. So a big population that utilizes this is knee replacements, hip replacements, um, ACL surgeries, any kind of ankle sprains or ankle surgeries, or if there's someone who's been, um, you know, told they have to use crutches or a cane to walk to take some of the weight off of that, that body part. We're allowed to use the uh, anti-gravity treadmill to modify their weight um, and get them walking normally so that they don't have uh, weakness or, or gait abnormalities when they're um, getting back to full weight bearing. From the time the patient comes in to the time they get in the machine, usually takes about 90 seconds. You just wear um, like a tight-fitting running short or, or leggings, or you can even put um, the shorts over your clothes. So you just pull it up, and there's a zipper around it, you zip yourself in, the machine will calibrate your weight and, and essentially uh, let you get started within a minute or two. You initially start at 100% of your body weight. With each successive progression down to a lower percentage of body weight, you can feel that you're um, becoming lighter, if you will. So we can go down as far as 20% body weight and uh, I think the, the moon, walking on the moon is about 18% of Earth's gravity, so we're not quite there yet, but it's, it's pretty close and it feels a little strange, but it's, 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 uh, it's pretty remarkable. So we have gait analysis software on the screen as well, so we can look at the person's foot as it hits the ground. So as a clinician, we really want to be able to um, kind of isolate what might be causing some of these issues or if there's any uh, predictive factors to that. So we can visually see what's going on because there's cameras in there that we can look at the screen. But it also shows us um, how much percentage of weight is being put on each foot, what part of the foot is hitting first, um, how long the strides are, and if there's uh, any way that we can track that, um, we can do that on the computer that's inside the machine, save that data, and send it to the patient's doctor as well, which is really helpful. Give us a call, stop on by, we can certainly uh, get you set up.